Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Keely and I'm so excited to have you here today. This is a fun video. I've never done anything like this before. I've uploaded like a few videos. It's a new channel. <laughs> Kaylee, I am a professional freelance makeup artist, esthetician, and all around beauty hack lover. I am so excited to try this product in today's video. Look what we have here. Lumino. Did I pronounce that right? Lumino. Anyways, it's one of those influencer hyped up products that's just kind of exploding everywhere and just seeing sponsor posts all over social media. So I got curious, I had to try it. I have tried whitening products in the past, but I have extremely sensitive teeth. Even just a few months ago, I did a professional whitening treatment. I loved it, I got good results with it. Like what, it's like 80 degrees outside and my windows are rattling all of a sudden we've got like a huge gust of wind out there. Kind of like it, I wanna go sit by an open window. I like stuff like that. Anyways, so I really liked my results with it. However, the whole thing was supposed to be no sensitivity, but I did still have a bit of sensitivity. I could feel it, especially down here. So, Lumino, it is a whitening kit usage seat. Did I even talk about that? This is a whitening kit, a teeth whitening kit. And their whole deal is that it was created by a dentist and it's supposed to be non-toxic. This is their oral essential, or maybe that's the name, Lumino Oral Essentials. <laughs> I don't know what this is. This is a kit. You can get it with just the strips, the whitening strips, um, which was what I was going to do. But then with the sale, it was like 40% off for the whole kit. It was, this was like about $30 for this whole kit. And it comes with the strips. So it comes with seven treatments, which is 14 strips. So top and bottom, seven treatments total. And then that comes with the mouthwash, their toothpaste, and I didn't know it, but a little cute little wooden bamboo-ish brush thing, toothbrush. From what I gather online, these strips are amazing and you can get a bigger pack of them, but the strips are supposed to be really good. And using them in conjunction with the mouthwash and the toothpaste, it's supposed to enhance and accelerate the whitening process. So I thought, why not just go all in and try this whole thing? For the whitening strips, you're supposed to use it once a day for the first four days, and then one to two times a week after that. And one more thing is I do have, like right here, I'm a little too aggressive when I brush my teeth, so the gum, I have a recessed gum line, which means that the gum gets pushed up a little bit and kind of gets stuck there. And so I actually do have some exposed nerves right on this side. I'm about as sensitive as they can come. Okay, so as you can see, this is what they look like. I don't know why I'm nervous. Oh, I didn't. It's not center. Oh well. That's okay. That's the tooth that has the recessed gum. It feels okay. Yay! It's not a flattering video. I did wash my hands. All right, now we're gonna wait. 30, wait, wait, 30. Which one is that for you? 30? I don't know, minute. Uh, Okay, I'm like one minute in and I already feel a little, like a little bit of a, a, like a sharp, minor sharp right here. Okay, it's been 30 minutes. I don't have any more sensitivity. I just had it for a couple, like, I don't know, maybe three-ish minutes, but I ended up pulling just this little part right here where I have my exposed gum line. I just pulled it down a tiny bit, just to be on the safe side. So now it's time to brush and rinse. Did they look any different? Okay, I actually think that they are a tiny bit wider. I don't know, is it my head? Let's get up close, let's get up close. Literally doing the middle. <laughs> right now, instead of just moving my camera. Okay. 
Can you see? I will keep trying this product over the next couple of days and then I will check in and we could compare side by side. Is Lumino worth it? We'll see. Gotta go. Bye. All right, I am back. It has been four days. I have whitened my teeth every single day for the past four days and I do have some thoughts. I think they are a little bit wider. I am happy with them. I wouldn't say that they're, you know, like 10 shades lighter, but I, I do think they're maybe like a shade or two. I don't know, what do you think with the before and after? I'd have to say my favorite part about this system is that I, I truly do feel like it is perfect for sensitive teeth. So the first day I did have, as you saw, I did have a little bit of sense. Well, actually I did have quite a bit of sensitivity for a couple of minutes over here on this tooth. But I noticed as the days went on, like the second day there was a little bit and I just kind of pulled the strip off of it. So it wouldn't be touching those nerves. And, but by day two and three, I didn't have any sort of sensitivity here. It didn't bother me at all. So on day two and day three, I actually left them on for about 45-ish minutes. Um, I'm not necessarily recommending that because the instructions say 30 minutes, but I don't know. I didn't have any sort of sensitivity and I felt like my teeth were okay. And so I was curious to see if it would make a difference leaving it on a little bit longer. I think it did, but again, use your own caution because I kind of went rogue with my timing. So I did use both the toothpaste and the mouthwash. And I am actually surprised at how much I enjoy these products because I haven't tested them on their own. I don't know if they're whitening my teeth on their own or if they're insisting in that just because I've been using the whole system all together. So morning and night, I use both of them. That's what the instructions say. I really enjoy that. There's a little bit of peppermint oil in it. So you do get a bit of a minty sensation. If anything, I do wish both of these had a little bit more of a kick when it came to the mint um, just because I like it. I love really strong minty products. I like it when it almost feels like it's burning my mouth. The toothpaste here, and it's not even that big of a deal, but it doesn't foam up like conventional toothpaste does. And so when I brush with this, after about a minute, the toothpaste kind of just breaks down and I feel like I'm just brushing with water, which is not that big of a deal, but if you really enjoy the foamy and all the minty, you may not enjoy this. However, I do think that they feel great on my sensitive teeth. Um, I have no complaints. I don't see any sort of fluoride in this toothpaste, so do what you will with that. All in all though, I'm happy with it. Yes, I think that in the past when I've gotten professional teeth whitening um, or even like the bleach or the peroxide products, I have had a more substantial difference in the shade of my teeth, but I do have to deal with the sensitivity of that. And so having kind of a middle ground of yes, it might take just a little bit longer. It might be a little bit more gradual, but it's healthier for the teeth as well as not causing sensitivity to my teeth. It's worth it to me. What do you guys think? Do you think that it made a difference? Are you curious? Do you want to try this product? Have you tried it? Tell me down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. I love to try product. It's so fun. That's Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, I hope you consider subscribing. Please give it a thumbs up. That helps me to know, especially right now while I figure out which kind of content I should be making for you guys. Anyways, I'm so excited to get started on the next video. I will talk to you later. Bye.